Hello and welcome to the MAC weather page for this Wednesday, May 16th and the window weather. Uh, planning will zoom from north to south as we see some pretty nice sunshiny days over the next three days. Highs in the 70s. Now how high into the 70s we get will depend on the uh, backdoor cold front and whether or not it makes it through the area. If not, we'll see highs in the upper 70s uh, to around 80. Looks like we'll certainly hit that today. But then uh, for Thursday and Friday, we could stay in the low 70s with the northeast wind. Again, the next chance of precipitation moves in for late Saturday. Medium range outlook over the next 6 to 10 and 8 to 14 days. We're going to be warmer than normal as it looks and uh, maybe a little bit on the wet side. And so it looks like we're going to have uh, plenty of uh, good growing weather coming up. If we look at the webcam view this morning, this is from London, Ontario. A nice sunshiny day, not only there, but across the area. And if we look at temperatures this morning in the upper 40s to low 50s for a pretty typical uh, late spring morning. And on the satellite view, you can see across the Great Lakes, the high pressure system has moved in, creating a wedge of uh, clear skies. Uh, clouds trying to hang tough over southeast lower Michigan into the Ohio Valley. Those will only be beaten back to the southeast as high pressure becomes more dominant over the next couple of days. You can see on radar activity well off to our north, but cold enough even for some potential snow mixed in as you get up further north into Ontario. But not here for the Great Lakes, temperatures in the 40s and 50s quite a bit milder and on the weather map this morning you can see that high pressure system that yesterday was off into the eastern dakotas and nebraska now moving into uh, illinois and southern wisconsin and again that'll very slowly just um, move over the area and take shop again we'll wait for the next system until late saturday or sunday before we see our next chance of precipitation as far as over the next three days the next 72 hours little to no precipitation across the great lakes and even on Saturday, it looks like much of that uh, day could also be fairly dry. So we could have almost four days, uh, hopefully, to get back out in the fields and get a lot of the planting uh, finishing up, and uh, at least as for uh, corn, soybeans. If we look at the uh, extended outlook, you can see warmer than normal for the next uh, 6 to 10 and the 8 to 14 day outlook, with much of the country being above normal. The only area near normal will be in Florida, and that's because, as you can see, above normal precipitation expected there, and actually much of the uh, growing regions of the United States, we expect uh, adequate moisture. So it looks like, uh, again, with warm and fairly wet conditions, looks like things are going to really rapidly grow here over the next two weeks. As far as the forecast goes, just beautiful sunshine today. Highs in the mid-70s to possibly around 80 or so. Clear tonight, low in the low uh, 50s, and then sunshine, windy, and again, we'll have mild conditions at least in the low 70s. Again, we're forecasting that uh, backdoor, backdoor cold front to bring us some northeast winds in cooler conditions. If this is the case, the warmest temperatures will be on the western side of the state. The coldest would be closer to Lake Huron and Lake Erie. And again, for Friday, highs in the low 70s with plenty of sunshine. And again, depending if that uh, backdoor cold front doesn't make it through, we'll be closer to 80. But right now, we'll say the low 70s, which will still be a really nice uh, uh next few days coming up. Thanks for stopping by and have yourself a great day and 73s to all.